In this video, I will show you how to get the best results with Minimax's image to video AI tool. You will learn how to create realistic videos, create emotions, add visual effects to scenes, and even extend your videos, along with some useful tips and tricks. So let's get started. To use Minimax, go to hiluoai.video through the link provided in the description. For the first three days after sign up, you will be able to generate unlimited videos, and afterward, you will receive bonus credits every day with the free plan. Once you are on the site, you will see an option to upload images in either JPEG or PNG format. There's also a prompt section where you can enter your video prompt, and on the right, you will find a button to enhance your prompt for a more refined result. If you prefer, you can leave the prompt blank and let the AI grasp the physics of the image and create a video on its own. Next, I will use Flux 1.1 Pro to create realistic images. And I will also use Glyph to access Flux 1.1 Pro for free, as it offers daily free credits to access Flux Pro. All you have to do is click on Build and then click on Add Block. From the pop-up list, choose the Image Generator option. Now in the Image Generation Model dropdown, select Flux Pro version 1.1. Then choose an image size, I will select 16 by 9. And you are all set to enter your prompt and start generating images. The trick to generate realistic images is to use prompts that resemble actual image file names, such as img underscore 2030.cr2 where CR2 is a file format used by Canon cameras. And just look at the realism of the image it generated. Now let's add the keyword woman at the end of the prompt and click run this glyph. Flux 1.1 Pro will generate a highly realistic image that looks like the real photo of a woman. And if you try again with the same prompt, you will get different results every time. You can also try img underscore friends dot jpg and here's the result. Can you tell it's AI generated? How cool is that? Let's replace friends with cat, and you will see that the resulting image of a cat is convincingly realistic. Feel free to try out different prompts with this method and watch how realistic the images turn out. To create videos from these images, I will return to Minimax and upload this image I made using Flux. Then I will enter the prompt, a woman enjoying herself, and enable the Prompt Enhancer option before clicking Create. It takes 1 to 10 minutes to generate a video, depending on how many are in the queue. The result is an impressively realistic video with smooth facial expressions and natural, consistent movements. I then added different emotions. In the first instance, the woman is laughing. Then, her expression changed to tears as she starts to cry. Next, her face transforms with anger. And finally, she is surprised, reacting with shock. Each emotion vividly changes her demeanor, showcasing a wide range of expressions. Now for the visual effects or VFX. First I prompted to make the man fly like a bird. The result was impressive, and there was almost no distortion. Next I poured different colored paint on a smiling woman, which turned out beautifully then transformed a car into Bumblebee, although the prompt still needs some fine-tuning for perfection. Finally, I made an airplane explode into dozens of Rubik's Cubes. The results were visually stunning. This makes it easier for users to create action-packed video effects with minimal effort. I even created rain and a mini tsunami inside a house. How cool is that? Minimax creates six-second videos. To extend the length of your videos, you can take a screenshot of the final frame and upload it to Minimax to generate a new video starting from that point. Then by joining these videos in a video editor, you can create longer, seamless sequences without losing quality. If you have any creative ideas or tips, feel free to share them in the comments. And if you found this video helpful, hit the like button and consider subscribing for more such AI videos. You may also check out these videos on the screen. And thank you for watching.